hello. Um, today is Wednesday, August 4th, 2021. Uh, first and most importantly, I would like to thank everyone who subscribes to my YouTube channel and reading my blog. I really appreciate that. If you're just dropping by to see who is Paymon, what he's talking about, thank you very much for dropping by. And um, I hope uh, my ideas will be interesting for you. Subscribe to me, or as well as my YouTube and blog channel. Uh, I also have published books. If you think my ideas are good, please support me from that end. Uh, the Islamic Republic of Iran, Body Shame, Women's Status in Society. Body Shame, Women's Status in Society. I'm using a Bible, Genesis 1, section 27. So God created man in his image. In the image of God, he created him. Male and female, he created them. Therefore, man and woman are equal. There is no difference between man and woman. Male and female genders must respect one another. And every disrespect is the same as disrespect to mighty God because we are created in God's image. Woman's body has autonomy, which is different than male autonomy. A female person moves away from childhood and begins to move to adulthood and begins to develop breasts. The breasts are part of a woman's body to nurture children. What did the woman do wrong that the breasts are posing a danger to society? Should she cut off her breasts after childbirth and stop the mullahs from passing laws against women's attire? Woman's body is more muscular around legs and broader hips to have babies in their wombs and carry them for nine months in their wombs. What should women do with their legs and their hips? Should women mutilate their bodies and the mullahs stop witch hunting women in the streets about their dress policy? God gave beauty to women and muscularity to men. This is why women and men are attracted to one another. This is just one point of view. Maybe someone comes and be more uh, scientific about it. But I'm just talking about my feelings the way um, I'm saying it. It is not an animalistic feeling. It is a natural feeling. Why does a man want to have an intimate relationship with another woman? A society has norms that governs social interaction among genders. There is no need for a mullah to tell different genders how to interact with one another. Woman's body is divine because woman's body nourish human being in their body. Women cannot do anything with their bodies. They are born that way. In conclusion, the Islamic Republic of Iran is ignorant about women's bodies and using hijab to sh body shame woman. The Islamic Republic of Iran goes as far as to deem woman's body as an instrument of evil. evil. Consequently, woman's status in a patriarchy society becomes an enigma. However, as God says in the Bible, I created man and woman in my image. In his image, not my image. Okay? Both men and women are equal and must be treated and respected equally. Okay, I will be speaking the Persian language. در رابطه با اینکه ملاها این همه قانون ها درست میکنن که زنهای ما رو خواهرای ما رو مادرای ما رو توی جامعه سرکوب کنن یه جوری بزننشون میان میگن که آره هجاب تو رایت کن خب خداوند گیتی در انجیل میگه که من شماها رو به صورت خودم به دنیا آمدم و من این نتیجه رو میگیرم که خب زن و مرد با هم برابر هستن این نتیجه من لزومی نداره من بیام به یک زن با چشم بد نگاه کنم اگه من به یک زن با چشم بد نگاه میکنم چکار کردم؟ به خدا بی احترام میکردم و هر گونه بی احترامی که به هر کسی بکنم در وحل اول به خدا بی احترام میکردم بعد به هم دیگه احترام بذاریم این از واجباته خب 
بدن زن وقتی که از بچگی دور میشه میاد بزرگ میشه خب سینه داره با همون سینه بچهش رو روش میده این زن چیکار کنه مثلا بیاد سینهش رو تیکه پاره کنه که ملاها راحت بشن بگه آها الان شد نه نمیشه خانوما پاهاشون درشتر از پاهای مرد بعد دوربر کمرش هم یه مقدار بزرگتر تقریبا به خاطر چی؟ به خاطر اینکه نه ماه بچه رو تو دلشون دارن تو رحمشون دارن یه چیز خیلی ساده است پزشکیه همچین چیز عجیب غریبی هم نیستش که ما بخواهیم بترسیم از زنا فرار کنیم زیبایی مال زنه مرد بودن مال مرده این یک واقعیت این یک چیز طبیعیه دیگه چیزی نیستش که ما بخوایم که صحبتش کنیم چی هست چی نیست خب این یه چیز طبیعه و باعث میشه که زن و مرد به هم دیگه بیفتن دنبال هم دیگه ولی به این صورت هم نیستش که یه مرد یه زن رو میبینه یه زن من رو می... مرد رو میبینه میخوام بیفتن دنبال هم دیگه نه یه همچین چیزایی نیستش نگاه کنید کلام مطلب اینه این ملاها در قرون وستا دارن زندگی میکنن توی تاریکی دارن زندگی میکنن و فکر میکنن که بدن زن بدن شیطانی در واقع بدن زن یه چیز شیطانی نیست یه چیز بسیار مقدسیه و باید مورد احترام جامعه قرار بگیره اینجوری نیستش که من بخوام ملا اینجوری فکر کنه نه شیطانی نیست و در یک جامعه مرد ساله روی تبدیل شده به یک انیگما یه چیز عجیب غیر اوه بدن زن چیکار کنم نمیشه این کارا زشته خدا ماها رو برابر آفریده همین چیزی که پادشاه ما محمد رضا پهلوی رضا شاه کبیر هم میگفتن و ما باید به همدیگه و به خانوما احترام بذاریم یه چیز بسیار مقدسی وقتی احترام میذاره به نفر یه چیز مقدسی